Hello everyone, it's Joe from OnePageZen.com and today in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to integrate your custom domain name email with Gmail so that you can use your custom domain name email in your Gmail account. So this is part two of a two-part tutorial. In part one we set up our custom domain name email with Zoho and now in this tutorial, which is part two, we are going to integrate that custom domain name email with Gmail. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go click the settings icon in the upper right hand corner of the screen. Then towards the bottom of the settings page, we're gonna click the email forwarding link. And now here towards the top of the page, we're gonna click the add email address link. Now I'm going to add the following email address. And this is the Gmail address that is going to host all of our custom domain name emails. So I'm going to click add. And here where it says delete Zoho mails copy, uh, click the yes button if you want to use Gmail exclusively to manage all of your custom domain name emails. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to click the verify link here. And now that I've clicked the verify link, I'm going to go back to my Gmail account. And you can see here I have an email from Zoho. So I'm going to click that. And I'm going to copy my confirmation code. Go back to Zoho and paste my confirmation code here and click the confirm button. Perfect. So now that we've verified the account, the next thing we're gonna do is head back to our Gmail account, click the gear icon in the upper right hand corner of the screen and go to our settings. And from here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to our accounts and import section and we're going to click add another email address. All right. So the email address that I'm going to add is user at onepagezen.com. And I'm going to uncheck this treat as an alias button here and go to next step. So here's how we have to configure this. In the SMTP server field, we're going to enter smtp.zoho.com. We're going to use port 465. And my username is user at onepagezen.com. And fill in your password. And we're going to use SSL encryption. And I'm going to click the Add Account button. All right, so the next thing we need to do is we need to confirm the email address here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to my Zoho account. And you can see here there is an email from Gmail in my inbox. So I'm going to click that email. And I'm going to click this link inside of the email. And here where it says, please confirm sending mail as user at onepagezen.com, I'm going to click the confirm button. Now, for me, this the confirm button didn't work because I've already verified the email address. But for you, it should work just fine. So after you've done that, go back to your Gmail account. And if you've done everything right, these unverified and verify links will have disappeared and in their place you will see a make default link. Now what you want to do is you want to click the make default link to make this custom domain name email your default email address for your Gmail account. That way you can manage all of your emails from your custom domain name email from your Gmail account. All right, and that's it for this tutorial. 
If you have any questions, uh, please leave them in the box below. Uh, also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you want to view uh, this tutorial with images and listed in a step-by-step -step fashion, uh, be sure to check it out at OnePageZen.com. Thanks a lot for watching.